How's it going guys? Coming at you with a review of these magazines right here, which is the ETS mags from Elite Tactical Systems. These magazines were sent to me by J&G Sales to review for you guys. Really, really cool mags. Uh, it gives you that tactical advantage that, you can, that you're able to see your round counts in them. You know, if you're reaching into your range bag and looking for your next loaded mag, you can you can see that they're loaded. And, you know, it gives you a lot of really cool advantages. But one of the things that uh, has plagued translucent mags in the past is that the fact that translucent polymers aren't necessarily the most durable polymers out there. And so so I wanted to really put these mags, not only just review the mags for you, but I wanted to put them through the test to just see how well they would hold up. Before we did the test, we took them out to the range to test function and reliability. Glock 22C. And as you can see from the videos, they ran perfectly, flawlessly, uh, functioned 100% reliable. Now from that point, what I wanted to do was I wanted to test their durability. So what we did is we did a drop test. We we fully loaded uh, both the, eight, the the Glock 18 mag and the Glock 19 mag, and we dumped them off the back of my, my pickup truck at six feet. So we dropped them multiple times on the base plates. And as you can see, the base plates are a little bit scuffed up, a little chewed up, but all in all, not in bad shape. And we dropped them onto their feed lips. And as you can see, there's some pretty good pitting in some of those feed lips there. As you can see from the side here, there was a little bit of deforming in the front part of the mag right there. Okay, um, so there was that on the 18 mag. On the 19 mag, you can see here, again, pretty good scuffing on the base plate and on the feed lips, pretty good pitting, kind of scuffing there as well. Uh, the only thing that broke on these magazines at all was a little piece of polymer that, a little a polymer chip that came out of the the follower on the Glock 18 mag. I didn't notice that until uh, right before I did this review where I took the magazine apart. What we did additionally uh, to the drop test is we ran them over twice with my pickup truck. And all you can see that happened from that is really just some pitting or 
scuffing that occurred in the side of the of the uh, the polymer there. All in all, though, it it uh, it took the the truck just fine. We ran over it once and we ran over it twice. And there you can you can see on the Glock 19 mag just some pitting there. Really, really nothing nothing super bad at all. After this test, we took them out and we ran them in the Glock 19 to see how well they would function, and they functioned flawlessly after the test. So that polymer chip didn't that polymer chip was kicking around in there uh, during that the post the post test function and reliability test function perfectly. So really, all in all, guys, these mags really really held up well. The, the packaging they come in is these, these little plastic sleeves here. Uh, they, they really tout uh, an eight foot impact resistance, chemical resistance, UV resistance. You know, UV will actually make polymer brittle over time and this will resist that a bit. It'll also resist extreme temperatures as well. What's also really cool is these magazines are compatible with any other Glock uh, base plates. So if you guys wanna use some of your aftermarket competition ba base plates, you can run them on these mags, which is really nice. I think all in all, guys, these mags held up really well to the durability test. You know, they got a little uglier, but uh, for the most part, you know, they still look pretty awesome and they function 100%, which is, is the most important thing about these magazines. So I really think they're good to go. I just want to take a second, guys, and thank JNG Sales for sending me these magazines to test for you guys. It, it's what made this review possible. So I'm going to leave a link in the description box down below where you can go to their website and you can buy some magazines from them. You know, it supports the channel and it also supports JNG sales and I really 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 appreciate it guys. If you guys have any questions or comments about anything that you've seen in this video hit me up in the comment section down below and don't forget guys if you like what you see to hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more videos just like this in the future. And as always guys thanks very very much for watching and we'll catch you guys in the next video. See ya.